Oh my god, dude, how do I keep doing this? Oh, and there that goes. That's gone. I. Yeah. I did that to myself. in her tail. Uh, I don't know my scale. It's in the car. Big, healthy fish. I'm going to say she's like two, two and a half. Uh, I think, anyway. Pretty big, though, for, for here. for you guys uh i had lost the footage from uh two days ago's little trip there where we kind of talked about the the diowa and um all in all it's a really really good reel will i buy another one um maybe uh, right now, I, I really do want to buy that uh, that Corrado, but it just seems to be like pretty hard to even get. Uh, seems like now it's selling out more than it ever has. Uh, what else? I mean, when it comes to the Daiwa, let me just grab this real quick. When it comes to the Daiwa, like functionality, castability, weight, comfortability, uh, it, it has all those things. It, it has the ability to cast um, relatively far. Um, I'm sure I'll throw in some like clips of just me throwing, um, minus you know me losing two lures today or three. So I lost about like forty, almost forty bucks in tackle. I feel like. Maybe not 40 bucks, it might be like 27. Um, but like, literally, I went in with the expectation that it was gonna be the, it was gonna be pretty good. I, I already gone in, like, I was like, all right. I, I watched one video and I watched a guy cast on it and I was like, okay, so maybe, maybe this thing's gonna be all right. And uh, to make the comparison between the Shimano and the Daiwa, it, I feel like it's pretty fair. Because for like $30 cheaper, you can get the same castability. You don't get the noise, you know, you don't get the DC brakes. Um, you know, you can still, you could still nest. It's, none of these things are fully idiot proof or you know, you might adjust your tension now wrong or your thumb might just kind of 
pull above that spool just a little bit and it might just kind of catch itself. But all in all, great reel. I recommend that if you're looking to buy a bait caster and you want to spend the, I think I paid one, it was like 140 or something, or 130, 130 dollars I think it might have been. I believe it was 130 dollars. Um, Cause I think my total came out to like 168 with the tour grade line. And uh, I, I recommend you buy it. If you don't want to almost spend what probably would tax spend 200, go with the Daiwa Tatula. Um, mine's the seven three to one. Then there's the eight. I think it's the eight one to one. Uh, I like I like where this one's at. I like the speed. Uh, it's not like it's not too fast. It's not too slow either. It's, it's like that happy medium. Um, we're going to try and get out a little bit tomorrow. Doubt it's going to happen. Uh, I, I'm supposed to be taking a trip to, to Massachusetts. I think the weather's going to be absolute trash. So I could still go, but I think the only thing we're going to do is I think we're going to grab some Chick-fil-A and I think that's about it. And I think I'm going to head home. I hope you guys enjoyed the last video and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, it's a little. It's gonna be a little bit shorter. So I hope you guys are, have been enjoying the drone because I've been loving the drone. I'm gonna eat. I have to go to work. So until next time, guys. I will see you. Well, whenever I see you. So you been sipping on egg best touch. Wait around time you acting real sus. Four or five bulldog get back you up. Go with a when I step in the club. Got a little bitch, big bag, big.